Click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon for watching more update videos. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum friends, this is Sami and you are watching Civil Engineers YouTube channel. Dear friends, today my topic is too much important for all civil engineers and the topic is the different types of soil bearing capacity. Let's start. If you did not subscribe my channel, so now you must subscribe this channel and like this video because per day I upload one video to this YouTube channel. If you need the BS civil engineering, BTEC civil engineering notes, so uh, engineering new information, so you are able to visit my website www.civilglobal.com. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe this channel. Let's start. First of all, I will tell you that what is bearing capacity of soil, okay? What is bearing capacity of soil? Just uh, I will define it, okay? What is bearing capacity of soil? Okay, so uh, I will just define it that in geotechnology engineering, bearing capacity is the capacity of soil to support the load applied to the ground. So this is called bearing capacity. How? So in geotechnology engineering, bearing capacity is the capacity of soil to support the load applied to the ground. Just what is bearing capacity of soil? In geotechnology engineering, bearing capacity is the capacity of soil to support the load applied to the ground. If you want to design the column, uh, beam, uh, for example, building, anything else, so uh, for that we have to check the bearing capacity of soil that uh, is the applied load can support this soil or not. Okay, so if this is the upcoming load of building anything else, okay, so this is the soil okay so this is the bearing capacity of soil this load okay so we can say simply i can tell you that the internal strength of the soil okay internal strength internal strength of the soil is called bearing capacity Okay, this is the upcoming load. So the internal strength must be support the upcoming load. So this internal strength of the soil is called bearing capacity, right? Now I will tell you that uh, uh, different types of uh, soil bearing capacity. So uh, we have a different types of soil. So there are for uh, that what is the strength of soil? So I will just tell you how, for example, just yes okay so uh, types of uh, types of soil safe bearing capacity kg per uh, kg per meter square okay different types of soil okay or i will just tell you types of soil safe bearing capacity safe bearing capacity kg per meter square right types of soil safe bearing capacity kg per meter square so we have a different types of soil so what is the bearing capacity for the different types of soil okay means the strength internal strength of the soil in kg per meter square okay so first of all i will tell you the first one okay so the first one uh, we have a fine loose and dry sand okay so fine are loose and dry sand so this kind of soil okay so it is able to support the 10,000 10,000 okay 10,000 kg 
per meter square. The first one, find loose and dry sand bearing capacity of soil is what? 10,000 10, kg per meter square, so the first one. Okay, so uh, the second one, compact, compact glay, okay? So this is the second type of soil, compact uh, glay. So uh, if uh, the glay or if the soil is compacted, okay, Compact, uh, compacted glay, so uh, this kind of soil uh, bearing capacity is uh, just uh, how much? 45, okay? So 45,000, 45,000 kg per meter square is the bearing capacity for the compacted clay, okay? And the second one, uh, we have uh, uh, the third one, sorry. The third one, uh, we have the other one that is called uh, compact gravel. Do you know gravel? Okay. So that is also 45,000 uh, kg per meter square, both of. Right? And the fourth one, we have a soft rock. Okay. Soft rock kind of soil. This soft rock kind of soil is also able to support the 45,000 uh, kg per meter square. Right? Okay. So, the other one I have to use or there is the place. Okay? And the fifth one, uh, we have a black cotton soil. Okay? Black cotton soil. This one uh, 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 this one kind or this kind of soil bearing capacity is the black cotton soil 15,000 kg per meter square right okay so this is the uh, other one sixth one we have a uh, and the sixth one uh, we have uh, also the uh, other one we have a uh, uh, medium glay okay so if the medium glaze, medium glaze, this one is uh, 25,000 kg per meter square, okay? And the other one is medium compacted and dry sand, okay? Medium, this one is also medium compact. and dry sand this one is also 25000 25000 kg per meter square okay and uh, the eight one the, uh, we have a, a, a other one uh, that one is hard uh, or hard rock okay hard rock hard rock kind of rock so this one uh, can support the uh, 330, okay, 3 lakh and 30,000 kg per meter square can support. Okay, this is the bearing capacity for the other one. And uh, we have also um, the compact sand also, uh, we have done this one, I think, compact sand. Sorry, the compact sand we haven't, okay? So the ninth one, uh, we have the compact sand, okay? Compact sand is also 45,000 kg per meter square, okay? So these are the different types of soil. So the first one is fine, loose, dry sand. Okay, so this is 10,000 kg per meter square. The compact glay is uh, 45,000 kg per meter square. Compact gravel, 45,000 kg per meter square. Soft rock is also 45,000 kg per meter square. And black cotton soil is uh, 15,000 kg per meter square. And the sixth one, we have a medium glay, 25,000 kg per meter square. The medium compact and the dry sand, 45,000 kg per meter square. And the hard rock is the three lake, 30,000 kg per meter square and the compact sand is also 45
thousand kg per meter square so this is the too much important topic for today so you must like this video and subscribe this channel for more updates so you can also visit my website www.sevolglobal.com okay thank you uh, see you in next lecture all the best bye